Uh, and this one right here, it's over an inch in diameter. So that's approaching golf ball size hail. That's golf ball's about what, inch and a half, inch and a quarter. So, um, and David, as you mentioned earlier, it doesn't matter what size it is. If it hits your vehicle or it hits your house and breaks your window, it certainly affects your life. So um, these are the latest shots that, we, that uh, we're getting from our viewers. So we encourage people to send in the shots that they have. If you see something on your property, uh, go ahead and send us the pictures and we'll get them on the air as soon as we can. David? Yeah, Gerald, I mentioned that because uh, when I was in Denver, we had a hailstorm that came through in five minutes called two billion dollars worth of damage. Okay. It can be uh, uh, it can be something very powerful and very quickly. And, and just uh, recapping where we are right now, the tornado threat over Wake County is abated, but the threat of severe weather continues across the viewing area. Hail is being detected by radar from eastern Chatham County to the west to Nash and Franklin counties in the east. This is what uh, Greg has been reporting uh, for the afternoon. Uh, yes, Greg. Uh, don't mean to interrupt, but I just want to, there's no tornado warning in effect for this cell, but there are indications that rotation has uh, perhaps started uh, with this storm that is just to the west of southern Moore County right now. And of course, Moore and Hope County are under a warning for that. Uh, Juna. So, uh, we obviously <laughs> want to keep a close watch on that potential for large hail but also indications of rotation there. Uh, I will note that this is farther away from the radar than some of the other ones we've been watching, so the beam is hitting it a little higher up, and just because you have rotation there Girls. doesn't necessarily mean you have it at the ground, Ma but it is a signature that is worth noting, and we'll certainly keep an eye on that storm. Also, real quickly, that's in Randolph County. Trees reported down across, uh, 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 let's see, 